Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is another weekly Sainsbury's shopping haul. This week it's an Easter edition as I thought I'd get in early and get some of our Easter eggs. So let's just get straight on in. I've got a pack of nine toilet rolls here. This is the one we always get. It's not that highly rated on their website but I quite like this toilet roll. It's, it does the job. <laughs> got my hand on some of these uh, quavers which I've been after for a while. I decided just to get the prawn cocktail one this time and maybe I'll get the salt and vinegar ones next time. My husband's not too keen on salt and vinegar so I've got the prawn cocktail ones and I'm sure we'll get through these during the week. Then these are the Easter eggs. These were a pound each. I mean they are tiny but they're for the nieces and nephew. So yeah, one each, they're only a pound. Um, you get what you pay for, I guess. Then we've got the big lint egg here. This was 10 pounds, I believe. It's the lint milk chocolate egg with Lindor assorted truffles. So yeah, it's just the mixture of the white dark milk truffles there for the in-laws. They'll share that big egg mini egg for my brother actually my mum's having one of these as well but it's really small she just said she wanted a small egg so that's what she's getting I actually got a substitute for a dairy free chocolate egg they gave us a cream egg one so that had to go back because my sister-in-law is dairy free so a cream egg easter egg wouldn't be good <laughs> I thought I'd try these out these are new they're gluten free they're for us, not for my sister-in-law. Um, milk chocolate mini rice cakes, a pack of four. Um, 138 calories, saturates 2.9, so it's not great, but as an alternative to a chocolate bar for lunch. I've got to give those a go. This is an alternative for my husband's chocolate bars. Mr. Kipling lemon layered slices. They were on offer for £1.50 for eight. That's not too bad. These are for my little girl, the yogurt flakes. I ordered strawberry ones and they gave us these ones instead. It's not a big deal, so that's fine. They're two pounds and that's the normal price. These were on offer for three pounds, the Maltesers. The little um, tiny ones that you get in celebrations. They're for my mother-in-law for Mother's Day to go with some other little bits that we've got her. Some more chocolates. These are really nice. If you haven't tried them, I'd recommend them. They were on offer for 75p, I think, from a pound. They'll just go with my brother's Easter egg. Some more teasers. We have more teasers in this house. Um, just a pack of free for, uh, for lunches throughout the week if we fancy a chocolate every now and then. We've got the option. Little pizza. This was really cheap. I'd recommend these. Um, what I normally do is just pop this in the oven and my daughter will have half for dinner one night and the next day she'll have it for dinner again or um, for lunch. You can pop your own veg on there or meat or just have it as it is. Some large eggs. We get through eggs quite a lot with omelettes, fried eggs, Yorkshire puddings, all that sort of thing. So yeah, they'll, they'll go down nicely. Some whole wheat spaghetti here that's only 55p. I'm going to try and do an original carbonara this week. Um, actually, I don't think I saw the bacon. If there's no bacon, I didn't see it. Then we won't be having the carbonara. No, we've not got the bacon here, Dave. No bacon, so we won't be having that. I also got this... Um, type of cheese like the feta cheese to do the tiktok pasta meal that i want to try i doubt my husband will like that because it's very tomato based but i will like it i'm sure and it looks good so i just want to try it and we've got some bananas here again on the greener side but hey i have got used to it now some more sausage rolls my daughter likes these so every now and then i'll pop a few in the oven for her to have for lunch some baking potatoes, an oxtail soup. I'll do a beef stew in the slow cooker again, and this is what I use. I just use this oxtail soup, a little bit of water, and then put in a load of veg, 
the beef and some potatoes and butter beans actually and then that's oh and some dumplings you can't forget that dumplings can you or the stew or do you have them without dumplings let me know but that's that's just wrong i can't do that these shreddies were on offer for a pound so i've got two to stock up hummus for the husband's lunch pitters for his lunch milk for the man upstairs and milk for us we've still got another one of these left over from last week so i just got the one for my little one this one for the husband bagels were on offer for a pound so we stocked up on two normally they're one pound sixty so this is quite a good deal if you like bargains and you want to hear about my tips and tricks then check out my video which is my top tips and chip top tips and tricks <laughs> a bit of a tongue tie there um on that so on money savings so check that out if you can dough balls again these were on offer these are really nice they were on offer for one pound fifty and they're normally three pounds they do taste well they're the pizza express ones they taste exactly the same as the ones in the restaurant and they come with a little garlic butter dip as well but i would never pay three pounds for those but we've got those and no bacon. So I don't know what I'll be using those for. King's Mill 50-50 bread. I'm just over to the veg. Some mushrooms, broccoli, some tomatoes for the pasta meal. Parsnip. Oh, the husband's just getting the bacon out now. That was going to get thrown in the bin. Well done. Thank you. So we will be having our carbonara. We must have missed that. So there we go. We're not going to complain to Sainsbury's now. Um, some more carrots, parsnips, a lemon, yellow pepper, salted butter. And lastly, the, this is so small, the um, buttered chicken breast joint. It says serves free, but it's, you know, it's tiny. But it just doesn't make sense for my little one will eat meat but not a lot so it's sort of wasteful for us to get a, you know a whole chicken even though it is cheaper let me know what do you do i suppose we could cook it up and have the rest for sandwiches but i don't know it just seems faff so i've got this and next week we'll probably have the gammon shanks because they were really nice so yeah this isn't a huge haul a bit chocolate heavy as you can see what's your favorite easter egg um i'm tempted to get the big smarty ones it's the one with the chocolate egg and then like inside the the actual egg are the little smarties oh it's so nice but eight pounds for one egg it just seems like quite a lot and is it me or have eggs got smaller i really think they have <laughs> maybe it's just because where i've got bigger i don't know let me know anyway what's your favorite easter egg have you seen any bargains Please do give this a like and subscribe if you're feeling generous. And thank you so much for watching. If you do like these hauls, then I've got plenty of other Sainsbury's hauls um, on my channel. So please do check them out. And for now, stay safe, keep well, and thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.